and welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install Zoom, the teleconferencing solution, in Firefox. So I've opened up my Firefox browser here, and most likely I've received a link as an invitation to join a Zoom meeting. So I've actually gone ahead and copy and pasted that. So I've copied it, and there is my URL for my Zoom meeting. Now, what I notice here, HTTPS, so I know it's going to be secure. This is from my personal account out at Central Oregon Community College. They give us this software to use to teach. So at this point, all I have to do is click on that link and it's going to go ahead and open Zoom. Now, if you notice here, um, the Zoom software is not installed and it's suggesting that I install the Zoom desktop. And I'm going to do that by saving the file as it says. Okay, then I'm going to come up here to downloads and I'm going to click on this executable. Now, I do want to make sure double checking, right? We want to make sure we're not getting fished. This software is great software to use, you know, daily in, in teaching and in communication, but especially now with the pandemic in the way of the coronavirus, a lot more meetings are going online. So for whatever reason you're using it, this is a great way to do it. But we want to make sure that we have zoom.us. Whatever preferences it, okay, just make sure you check zoom.us that we can trust that this executable is safe for our computer. Now, as you can see, it's going to go ahead and it is going to install the Zoom client. Now, because I've clicked on that link to join a meeting, it's going to dynamically install the Zoom client. I shouldn't even have to close my browser. Okay, and in this case, I'm going to just put in the name student. I'm going to say join meeting and it is going to connect me. Now on my other computer, I have a meeting going. So you can see me over here. Hello, there I am right there. I am the instructor and this is the student. So we're actually looking at my other video cam where I have the program opened on another computer as the instructor. Now from here, what I'm going to do is join the audio. I want to make sure I can, by the way, go down here and I can test the audio here. So you're going to want to make sure you join the audio. If you have a webcam, you're going to enjoy join here and then you're online. Now as what you can see here is that the instructor or my other computer is actually sharing their screen. So this is a great way I can share my screen. I can give a presentation live. I can look at student records, do whatever I need to do and know that I'm doing this through an encrypted safe connection. So as you can see, I don't want it to open up my email. Come on now, we'll close that and we'll let it open up something else like my Google Calendar. So there it is. There's the meeting as you can see and we are ready to go. Take care, I hope this helps.